Yeah, how am I back up? Nee. Well, I... I just don't know. It's like a... Hang on. Who's that? Over there. I don't know who that is. Yeah, do you know who that is? Yeah. A Decepticon, hey? Well... Yeah. And he looks to be carrying a sword, you say? Well, there's only one room for one sword-wielding maniac on this field of battle. Yeah. Yes, yes, it's technically a table. Who cares? Oi, you! You go f we want. Come over here, young man. Me and my friend Nye over here would like to have a talk with you. Alright, Gov. Don't know what it's going to accomplish, but alright. Now, what do you want? Well, you seem to be carrying a sword. Yeah, so? There's only one... There's only room on this table for one sword-wielding maniac. But you're carrying a straight sword! Mine's a curved sword! Doesn't matter, my good fellow. What matters is... You cannot be here because I am the only swordsman around. Look, Gav, I have nothing against you Autobot types, except rebelling against Galvatron, but that's none of my business. None of your business. You're a Decepticon. Yeah, I follow... Galvatron's orders to the letter. But I don't care who's who. Anyone can believe in anyone. Anything in my books. As long as they're civil to each other. Civil to each other? Decepticons destroy worlds. Well, that's not my problem, is it, Gov? I made my bread. Now I sleep in it. You made your bread. It's made your bed, you utter ignoramus. Yeah. What do you mean you agree with him? Yeah. He's an idiot. Yeah. Takes one to know one. What do you mean, takes one to know? <gasps> you just did. You just did not say that to me. Yeah. Uh. I can come back at another time, Govs. I really don't need to be here. You shut up, you Decepticon heretic. You stay here and you like our argument. As you say, Gov. But I get off for lunch in five. That's fine. Just stay here and wait till we're finished. All right, Gov. Now listen, you little statue of a... What are you, actually? Nyeh. You're not sure. Hmm. Well, not sure. I say that man is a Decepticon and a sword wielder. And there's only room enough for a sword wielder... One sword wielder, sorry, in this town. Yeah, isn't this? What do you mean it isn't a town? It's a table. It's a town, obviously. Look at that black building over there. Yeah. 
That is not a chair. Chairs are comfortable. That thing is huge. It's bigger than me. Yeah. Oh, shut up. Look, Gov, I have nothing against you, but uh, I'm gonna have to shoot you. My gun's gone out of my hand, excuse me. Give me a second. Ah, oh, thanks, magical hand from out of nowhere. It's very thoughtful of you for helping me. Much appreciated. Now, you're an Autobot, I'm a Decepticon, so I'm gonna have to shoot you in the back. God, this gun is top heavy. Ah. Gotta arrange myself. As I was saying, I'm gonna have to shoot you. Oh, as you will. Wait, you're not gonna stop me? No. Why why not, Gov? I'm old. Yeah. So, Transformers are basically immortal. Oh, I don't feel immortal. You're literally one of the first primes. You're basically Jesus to two Cybertronians. Yeah. Oh, now we go back to how he knows about Jesus. Honestly, can you give nothing up? Look, I'm going to shoot you now. Yeah. What now? What did you say, Nia? Nia! I think it's going to come out. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Go ahead. Try and shoot me. What? Try and shoot me. This feels like assisted suicide. I'm just saying. Shoot your weapon. Uh. Galvatron never always said never give up a free shot. <laughs> that means coming out. Work. Work. Oh, God damn it. Oh, what did I say? Top heavy. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, no, no, no. Come on, come on. You can fix yourself. You can fix yourself, Razor Wolf. Come on. Come on. Okay. There we go. Is that your real name, Razor Wolf? No, but my name's so forgettable, I've forgotten it. <sighs> Decepticon names. Hey, everyone remember Starscream? Yes, because his name literally means giant... Gas, explosion, shout. You have a good point there. All right, what about Galvatron? Galvin, it's a metal found in space. Tron, machine. It's not that hard. Okay, what about Skywarp? Because it's bloody original. It's starting to sound like me. Yes, because our voice actor is getting tired. Oh. Well, should we stop? Not for another minute. I'm over here talking to Nye. Nye! Alright, alright. No need to get too sarcastic. Maybe we should just end the video so me and... Near here can have a good talk. All right, I'll go uh, have a coffee. Yes, you do that. Near. Oh, near says coffee can be bad for your digestive system. I know that. Near. It can also lead to various forms of cancer. 
Wait, what?